Hello again, folks. This is uh, AL Urban Prep again, uh, second video. Uh, as promised, uh, this is the uh, little uh, kit I keep behind the back seat of my truck. Or, yeah, behind the seat of my truck, I should say. Um, it's an M16 ammo pouch, United States Army issue. These things are great for hiking. Uh, little survival kits, uh, uh, bug out kits, uh, they're, they're great because they're durable, they last forever, they got the nice belt clips on the back and they'll hold a ton of stuff. You can put flashlights in the side pouches, uh, small water bottles if you, you know, uh, just anything you can stick back there. I don't carry a lot in this one, but I um, um, carry some stuff anyway. Ring poncho, cheap, disposable, same ones I used in the other one. Um, this right here makes a good filter. Take your t-shirt off, shove it in, pour water into it. It'll filter debris out of the t-shirt and prep that water for boiling or for other, um, you know, purification methods. No substitute for that. Cheap too, five bucks or less usually. Paracord, carry it and everything. Pencil and paper, might need to leave a note um, for somebody, you know, it's there, pencil and paper. Um, signaling, same mirror as last time, Walmart Automotive Department, they sell them two packs, pretty cheap. Great mirror though. Safety pins, you can use them for everything. Uh, another one of the swag, uh, former employer knives, these things, I wish I'd gotten a box from the former employer, these things are nice, heavy, they're, they're not a good working knife, I mean, you know, they'll break on you, but they're heavy duty enough that you can do most things with them. Thermometer, compass, flashlight, magnifying glass, biggest thing on it is the whistle, if you're lost, if you need help, that's your, that's your advice right there. Pocket flashlight, little uh, LED flashlight, bottle opener, good good stuff. My little fishing kit with the broken sticks, described in the first video. Hold it, put the string between your fingers, you can fish like that. Put your hooks and your, and your bobs. Um, don't have a first aid kit in this one because I keep a first aid kit behind the seat of the truck, but Benadryl. Those of us with allergies of bee stings and whatnot. Uh, flint and steel. Uh, Harbor Freight again. Buy them in bulk when they're on sale. Get them dirt cheap. Um, for starting fire, same thing we had the last one. First kit, dryer lint. Your wife will love you for cleaning the dryer lint out. She'll think you did it as a favor, but you're doing it for, for starting fires. 35 millimeter film tubes. These things are wonderful. Get your hands on these. They're waterproof. They'll hold a ton of stuff. Matches. Um, you know, flint and steel matches starting fires. These are uh, strike on box. They're not strike anywhere but. And they're not waterproof. But if you dip them in candle wax, that'll preserve the tips. Um, like I said, I carry a separate first aid kit. I got a few band-aids for boo-boos. Um, little sewing kit like the other one. This is one I won at a um, uh, IT security thing. I think I was the first or second one to hack into the server and what I got for, the, for my efforts. Um, same multi-tool, credit card size multi-tool that I had in the first pack. Uh, if you didn't see the first video, it comes with a little ID card, tells you what it does. It's like 10 different tools, dollar a piece on eBay, buy them in bulk, 10 bucks, save shipping. Works real good. The loaf pan, the primary guiding force of this particular um, uh, video. It scoops, it shovels, it collects snow, it digs, it boils water, it collects water, it carries water, it does everything cook in it, drink out of it, boil water in it, get a four pack around the holidays at Walmart for next to nothing. Um, 
and it, plus it gives rigidity to the survival pack so uh, you can take off the shirt you're wearing or tear a part of it off put it in the bottom of the of the um, ammo pouch and hard filter the water get all the debris out of it right into the pan throw it on top of the fire boil it and drink it it's good to go you can add to this subtract from it based on where you're at what you need what you think you need and um, but this is a this is a this is a kit that can really help you out in a, in a tough time so keep it in mind use it build from it build to it um, Wait till the next video. We'll come up with something else. Uh, don't know exactly what yet, but uh, I want to do some outside bush crafting stuff, some field craft. I want to do, you know, some hands-on build fire, some hands-on filter water, um, some different stuff that I picked up over the years and from my military time. Um, anyway, we'll be out here for now, and we'll catch you later.